who was coaching the Redskins. 40 men for 60 minutes can't be beat if they stick together. Well, unless, of course, you're Long Beach State playing at Death Valley against Clemson. Let's see what uh, George had to say to the younger guy as opposed to the older veterans. You've come a long way. You've made a lot of progress. You're prepared. You're together as a team. We have to go out and keep our poise. And the most important thing is to stick together all the way through. Be happy for the other guy's success and be physical and hit, 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 hit. I'm proud to be your coach. Sounded good, but didn't look good, coach. Take a look. Quarterback Todd Student right into the awaiting arms of Arlington Nunn. That's an interception for a touchdown. Seven to nothing, the Tigers with 9.38 left in the second quarter. Frank Howard's rock had Clemson motivated. Quarterback Deshane Cameron scoots through the Long Beach line into the end zone, an 11-yard run, 21 to nothing to score at that point. Then just 122 left in the half. Rodney Blunt will go to work this time, a two-yard touchdown run. Clemson up 28 to nothing at the intermission. Opening kickoff of the second half, and you see this early in games in college football. Special teams aren't up to snuff, and they really weren't up to snuff here. Take a look at Doug Thomas playing kick return. Turner, 98 yards for the touchdown run. Clemson would go on to win the game by a final score of 59 to nothing. The Tigers almost uh, equaling George Allen's years of age in scoring. He's 72. Clemson got 59, and they at one point had six yards rushing after 16 rushes in the first half of